Let's take a closer look at a case of four week early loading after a sinus lift using the Aqua system. CBCT interpretation confirmed residual bone height at 6.91. This case was classified as sinus class 3. Here's the edentula site at number 27. First, use G5.0 tissue punch for soft tissue removal. For sinus lift, use the SCA kit with an initial drill G2.0 and a 6 mm stopper. Continued with a master kit using a surgical drill. The SCA kit S Reamer G3.2 was used with 7.0, 8.0, and 9.0 mm stoppers, confirming membrane detachment with a depth gauge at each step. Aqua system lifted the membrane with 0.1 cc per millimeter. The graft was hydrated using a synthetic bone mix, loaded graft into sinus, elevated with condenser, spread laterally using SCA kit bone inserter and spreader. After final drilling with master kit, IS to implant was placed into the grafted bone in the maxillary sinus. The ITV measured 40 newton per centimeter, and the healing abutment was connected. PA and CT imaging confirmed the successful outcome of the sinus graft. Intraoral scanning was performed on the day of implant placement, and the final prosthesis was placed for weeks later. Check out more cases on the GEO website.